Lily Hornig was one of two women working in the chemistry department at Los Alamos during the Manhattan Project, until they were both fired and reassigned. I had a job in the chemistry department doing what was called uh, fundamental wet research, which was involved uh, uh, working with plutonium determining the solubility of various plutonium salts. There was essentially nothing known about plutonium chemistry at the time. And uh, there was one other woman in the division. She and I worked together, and we did our little procedures and put them under the Geiger counter. And it wasn't terribly inspiring. And then they got the first results from Hanford with the bad news about plutonium-240 which was much more active than 239. And the first response was to fire both of us instantly. And I complained a bit about that. And they worried, obviously, about reproductive damage. And I tried delicately to point out that they might be more susceptible than I was. (laughs) That didn't go over well. 